Hello everyone. Welcome back to Rizat Graphics. In this short After Effects tutorial, I will show you to export or render your projects in H.264. Whether you have an older version of After Effects or a newer version, I will cover all steps. So, watch the video till the end. Without wasting any more time, let's get started. Open Adobe After Effects. Right click on the footage, and select new comp from select. Now, I want to render this footage in H.264 format. If you have an older version of After Effects so what will you do? Let me show you the first method. Select the composition. Go to composition. And click add to render queue. Then click the lossless. As you can see, we don't have the H.264 format. So, select the quick time. If you don't see the quick time format. So you need to install quick time. The download link is in the description. Anyways, select the quick time format. Go to the format option. And select H.264 video codecs. And click render. Right click on the rendered footage. And go to properties. The footage is rendered in move format. And the file size is too much. It's very easy to compress the file size and convert it to H.264 format. Just download the Handbrake software. It's a free software. If you face the runtime error after installation, Just download and install. Net 6.0 runtime. Open the handbrake. Drag and drop the footage. Select the MP4 format. Then click the browse button. And choose the file location. And type .mp4 format. And click save. Then click on start in code. Now, the video size is compressed. Cool. It's working perfectly. Open Adobe After Effects again. Select the composition. Go to composition. And add to the render queue. Click the lossless. As you can see, we don't have the H.264 format. So, go to the edit menu. And then preferences. Then select output. And select show deprecated formats in output module settings. Press OK. Click the lossless. Cool. Now, we have the H.264 format. Select the H.264 format. And click render. Now, our footage is rendered in MP4 format. And the file size is only 49.1 megabytes. It's working perfectly. If you are using the newer version of After Effects, then what will you do? Let me show the third method. I am using Adobe After Effects 2019. Create a new composition from the video footage. Unfortunately, we don't have the H.264 format in the newer version of After Effects.
and we don't have any format option in preferences. So, select the composition. Go to composition, and add to the Adobe Media Encoder queue. Select the H.264 format, and click Render. I hope this was helpful, and you've learned a lot from this tutorial. If you are new to this channel, please subscribe and press the bell icon to get notifications. I'll see you next time on Rizat Graphics. Thanks for watching. Good luck.